Good afternoon. The subject of this presentation is cement replacement by used paints in plaster mortar mixtures. The authors are from Technical University of Cluj-Napoca, Faculty of Civil Engineering, Romania. The author's name are Adrian Christian Siomin, Maria Lordena Tsimsishan, Anna Maria Zaharia, and the Dean Daniela Luciamania. Chapter 1 Introduction In 2015, the United Nations set through the 2030 Agenda 17 Sustainable Development Goals to be implemented by all member countries. The 12th goal needed for sustainable development is the production and consumption of products or materials in a responsible manner. Starting from the importance of sustainable development, as well as exponential growth regarding the manufacture of construction materials, in the experimental program, used paints was recovered from the construction site to create new recipes for plaster mortars by replacing cement in different percentage. If you add the population growth by 2050 to 9.6 billion inhabitants, it's imperative to find the best waste management solutions so as to reduce the use of resources and raw materials used by construction of buildings. Abstract. This research started from the fact that the humanity exploits on an industrial scale and chaotically consume the raw materials that this planet offers, without realizing the importance of reusing waste and the possibility of introducing them in the production of plaster mortars. In order to reduce the cost of transporting and transferring waste to the landfill, most of the builders, at the stage of systematization of land, bury all the waste. Through the waste management, construction materials are recovered, in this case, used paint, and reused in the production of plaster mortars. Starting from plaster mortars mixture, the cement was replaced in a percentage of 10% and 15% with used paints. Chapter 2 Experimental Program The experimental program developed within the laboratory of the Faculty of Construction of the Technical University of Cluj-Napoca started from a standard recipe of plaster mortar called CS4. The composition of the recipe of plaster mortar are Portland cement without addition, sand and water, in which the cement was gradually replaced with water-based used paint, according to the table below. Chapter 3 Result The experimental program included two stages, determination on fresh mortar and determination hardened mortar. Determination on fresh mortar The determination of the density in the fresh state was performed by introducing the freshly homogenized mortar in a cylindrical vessel with known characteristics. The mortar was compacted according to its consistency. With the help of a balance, the vessel was weighted with fresh mortar, obtaining the mass. In the fresh state, for all three recipes of plaster mortars, determination of the density were made and the results are presented below in table number 2. Determination of the hardened mortar, bending tensile strength. To test the tensile strength by bending, the plaster mortar was poured into molds, after which it was compacted on the vibrating table, obtaining nine specimens with the size of 40 40 160 mm. These were tested at intervals of 3 days, 7 days, and 28 days, and the results are presented in the next steps in figure number 4. The determination of the tensile strength by bending was performed with the help of the automatic bending test machine, fulling Michaelis equipment, in which the obtained specimens were introduced. After freezing a specimen, the equipment was started, which locks automatically when the prism is broken, and the value of the breaking force was read. The bending maximum strength represents the unit effort by reporting to the maximum bending moment to the resistance modulus of the section. Thus, the tensile strength by bending was calculated with the relation between breaking force, distance between supports, and side of the section. The obtained results are presented in the figure below, respectively, figure number 4. 
Compressed is trapped. Using a hydraulic press provided by the Laboratory of the Faculty of Construction, the test specimen heads were tested for the compression at the same time intervals as for determining the tensile strength by bending, respectively 3 days, 7 days, and 28 days. After settering the specimen in the hydraulic press on the lower plate, bring the fixed plate as close as possible to the upper surface of the sample. The hydraulic press is started, and when the sample is destroyed, the manometer locks on the value of the braking resistance, as you can see in the figure below. Compressive thread is calculated by the relation between compressive force and the area of the sample required for compression. The results regarding the compressive strength are presented in the figure below, respectively figure number 7. Chapter 4 Interpretation of Results Contributions The personal contribution of the experimental program is the replacement of the percentage of 10% and 50% of the amount of cement with used paints for the preparation of plaster mortars. The results obtained by recycling used paints as a cement substitute in different percentage, respectively 10% and 50% of the amount of cement used for the preparation of plaster mortar, highlight the contribution of the reduction of raw materials, respectively the recycling of construction waste and environmental protection. Bending strength. By replacing the cement with 10% used paints, according to the C410C plaster mortar recipe, you can see the increase of the bending strength at 28 days compared to the C4 standard recipe by 20.13%, as you can see below in figure number 8. By replacing the cement with 15% used paint, according to C450C plaster mortar recipe, you can see the increase in bending strength at 28 days compared to the C4 standard recipe by 8.87%, as you can see below in figure number 9. Compressive strength. By replacing the cement with 10% used paint, an insignificant decrease of the compressive strength in the C410C recipe can be observed at 28 days compared to the mortar in the C4 standard recipe by only 0.82%, as you can see in the figure below, figure number 10. In the case of the C450C mortar recipe, by replacing the cement with the 50% used paints, a decrease of the compressive strength compared to the mortar from the C4 standard recipe by 47.7% can be observed at 28 days, as you can see below in the figure number 11. Chapter 5 Conclusions The results obtained from the experimental program highlight the fact that the most efficient recipe, both fresh and hardened, is the C410C by replacing 10% of the amount of the cement with used paints for the preparation of the plaster mortars. The explanation of how the resistance variation will be the objective for the next step of the experimental program using MRI and SEM type investigations. This result will be presented in the following papers. The reference for this paper are presented below. Thank you for your attention.